Hey everyone, Darren Eastman here, Product Manager for GitLab Runner. For today's speed round, we'll cover the use of our recently published Docker image that automates the provisioning of a virtual machine with the runner, and that virtual machine will, will have the GitLab Runner, and that runner will be automatically pre-registered against your time GitLab project. This is picking up on the speed run from last time where we were previewing a bit of that capability that we had been building out as part of our 13.4 release. The target um, cloud platform in this case is Google Compute Engine. Um, for folks that are interested um, in looking into details of this particular work, um, here is the link to the project repo, um, so you can take a look at the details there. Uh, again, this is part of our broader strategy of simplifying or making CIC super easy for customers by simplifying the uh, or automating the installation of, of GitLab runners to target environments and then long term simplifying the management capabilities, simplifying the management of runners at scale. So today we'll just be covering um, one of the first features as part of that evolution in our roadmap is this idea of having a Docker image where everything is prepackaged and then by simply using a simple Docker command, um, you will or a provision of virtual machine that will have GitLab runner and that runner will be pre-registered for you against a target um, GitLab project. So in the particular project repo here, you'll see the readme file. And so today we're just simply, we're covering this very simple Docker command. Um, and what it's gonna do, it's gonna pull down, if it hasn't done so already, if this is the first time that you're running this command, it'll pull on the image from the GitLab registry and then it'll run the commands using these parameters. And only it takes three parameters, your registration token, which is a registration token from your time to get that project, your Google Compute project ID, and your Google Compute zone. So I'm just gonna bring this over into a command prompt uh, and run the command. I already have everything set up on my end. And again, the three parameters are your registration token, your project ID, and your Google Compute zone. You hit enter. Give it a couple of seconds. And if again, this is the first time you're running this, it will have, um, you would, it will need to download the image from our registry. In my case, it's already done so. And so now it's actually running the script. And so now we will prompt you to copy this URL into your browser. I'm gonna choose this account, hit allow. And now I've gotten the code that I would need back in the script. The verification code, I paste it in here. Hit enter. And now what's happening in the background is that we're using Terraform to automatically create these virtual machines that will have a GitLab runner that will register it against your project. I've already done this before, so I won't go forward and, and do it here. Um, but in your case, once you complete the, um, you hit enter, you'll be able to go into your Google Compute, your, your, your Google Compute, um, Compute account. You'll see the virtual machine. In your GitLab project, you will notice that a runner has been registered against your project. Um, so I'm looking, we're looking forward to continued feedback from your users in our community around this type of this type of capabilities as we look to again simplify um, the automation, the installation of runners, automate that process for you, uh, and so on. So in future um, speed runs, we'll continue um, looking at some of the additional capabilities that we're building out in this space. Um, so looking forward to sharing with you then. Cheers.